What's up, YouTube? Last video here from Extreme Overclocking. I went video game hunting this weekend. The first in a long time. And boy, I'm glad I did. Because I found some great stuff. Alright, from least to greatest, um, we're going to go ahead and start off with this. This is a new collection I'm starting. It's the. I want to collect every single series of Pokemon cards. Yes, even the TV shows. So, the only non gaming related pickup. And that reminds me of this other thing I forgot. Oh, yeah, and I bought five packs of those, and I opened two. I just wanted a little pack designs, so I don't care. Probably not worth that much anyway. He's uh, first. After that, I went to. And this is for my collection, except for one of these, which I'll show at the end. This is um, I collect for the original Xbox, and I'm getting ready to start collecting for the PS2. But I'm not gonna. I'm gonna sell the one I got. First, I got Fantasy Star Online. Complete. Good condition. Neck, and I think. Xbox Connect, you can still play on, online and stuff. I got Links, time, the Time Sweeper. Complete. This one I remember, I remember from my kid, my childhood, uh, Narnia. Complete. One I've been wanting to play is uh, Harry Potter, Chamber of Secrets. Looking for Sorcerer's Stone out there, so if you can have it, I might trade you for it. I uh, never heard of this one. Goblin, Unleash the Horde. Looked kind of cool. It was only about four bucks, so all these were about four dollars. Didn't feel like that was too much to spend. And I got Tie Two, the Tasmanian Bush Rescue. Complete. All these complete, in good condition. Next, got this to resell because it sells for a decent amount of money. Did not know that was in there. Actually, it's uh, Grand Theft Auto San Andreas, Grand Theft version. Complete with the poster of that chick. So you like to, you know, get off to that, and that's your deal. Has the disc and a memory card, which will make it sell even for even more. And I think, yeah, this disc is pretty good. So I got those. Next, we'll go with these. I picked up these for seven dollars piece. First for resale. Well, I was gonna keep them, but now I'm gonna resell. Pokemon Silver and Pokemon Red, and they both save. That's pretty neat. Next, we got some. Nintendo manuals here. Some of these I'm going to keep for myself. So, first up, we got, and these are going on Nintendo Age. So, if you want these, I'm looking for Nintendo, um, Super Mario Bros. 1, Super Mario Bros. 2, and Super Mario Bros. 3, and along with Contra, maybe. But I might have to offer a lot, a lot for that. But I don't know. We'll figure that out when the time comes. This one, Super Mario Bros. I'm going to keep. And these were 50 cents a piece, so I'm going to get more eventually. Super Mario Bros. 3, I'm also going to keep. Super Mario Bros. and Duck Hunt, I'm going to keep. I haven't decided if I'm going to keep this one yet. And it's Metal Gear. You can see that. And it has the, the fold-out poster, too. So if you want that, then it might have to be something good. And then I got Super C. A Power Pad manual with World class track meet included, so that one more desirable. Another Super Mario Bros. Hunt, which I'll be trading that off. Another Super Mario Bros. 3, I'll also be trading that off. And mine, Super Mario Bros. 2. So I'll be keeping that one along with these Wizards and Warriors 3, Wizards and Warriors 2, Iron Sword, and just plain old Wizards and Warriors. Also have another Super C. I think this might be the. Yeah, this is the one 
that uh, kind of falls out, but it's just because the staple's loose. The manual, the manual itself's in pretty good condition, so if you want to restaple that, if you want to trade it, there you go. This one is immaculate condition, Super C. Um, Ninja Gaiden. And in pretty rough condition, Contra. <laughs> it, it does the same thing. So if you want to restaple that, that's up to you. And Gyro Might. We also have, for the N64, and these are all up for trade, we have Daycon Racing, Star Fox 64, Mario Party 1, and Worms Armageddon. That one, you're going to have to trade for. <laughs> I think Sick Cooper actually needs that, so if you want this, buddy, trade me a thin yes. Or something. Anyways, now on to the two Nintendo games I got. One I'll be keeping for my collection, one I won't be. But one I'll be keeping, and I got these for $3 a piece, is Kirby's Adventure. Mint condition. And then the one I'll be selling, obviously. It has a little bit of writing right here, but not that noticeable. Is stack up three dollars, fifty dollar game. I'm gonna be selling this t to get more common titles. Well, this is kind of uncommon, but common titles that I could play. And I want to play. I don't really have a Robbie Robot yet. I don't plan on getting one for a while. So that one will be selling to fund the collection and make a little bit of money back. So what I'm selling and slash trading. So I'm selling this on Amazon. These two will be getting sold on Amazon as well. This will be getting sold on Amazon. And these are up for you guys. So you can trade for me. Uh, depending on what the deal is, I might just trade you all of them. But these three are going to, or this one's going to cost you a little bit more. And that was mine. And that Mario has a slight tear right here. But this one just had a little bit of sticker, sticker residue from some stickers that you can get off pretty easily. So those are all there. And thanks for watching, YouTube. It's my first gaming pickups. Peace.